Hey, it's Elliot here. If you're trying to remove the MDM lock on your iPhone and looking for a quick, easy, and safe way to do it, you're in the right place. Forget about paying for sketchy services or downloading random software that could harm your device. Not only can that cost you, but it also puts your phone's security at risk. There's a much better and completely free way to get rid of the MDM lock, and it works perfectly on both iPhones and iPads. Ready to find out how? Let's get into it. Now, a quick reminder, this method is for responsible use only. If you own the device but forgot your access info, this is for you. We don't support bypassing security on stolen devices. Respect the law and others' rights. Our video follows YouTube's guidelines, so let's keep things above board and continue. When trying to remove the MDM lock, you might come across all sorts of online tools or methods. But a lot of them are unreliable, complicated, or downright sketchy. If you want something that actually works without any hassle, Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app is a fantastic choice. This web app removes MDM restrictions quickly and safely, even if you have no technical experience. And unlike other methods, this one doesn't require you to deal with confusing software or risk damaging your device. Most of the time, MDM locks are on devices that were given out by companies or schools. Once those devices are no longer in use, they get sold or passed on without the restrictions being removed. So if you found yourself with an iPhone or iPad like this, there's no need to worry. All you need to do is open your browser, whether it's on your phone or computer, and go to unlockhere.com. This site uses AI to help you unlock any mobile phone restrictions. Once you're on the page, you'll meet Nifty, their AI bot. From the list of options, select MDM lock. Next, pick your device. For iPhones, you'll choose iPhone, and if you're dealing with an iPad, there's an option for that too. Now, you'll need to enter either your device's IMEI or serial number. For iPhones, it's always the IMEI. For iPads with cellular capability, you'll use the IMEI as well, but if your iPad doesn't have cellular service, just enter the serial number. To find either, press the sleep button on your locked device, press it again, and tap the eye icon on the bottom right. That's where you'll find your device info. Don't forget to enter your device information in the next step. You'll also need to provide some basic details to connect the order to your account. It's important that the information you provide is real so you can receive the confirmation email. Once you've submitted it, check your inbox for the confirmation code. If it's not there, don't forget to look in your spam or junk folder just in case. Next, agree to the terms, confirming you're not trying to unlock a stolen device. Then start the process and solve the CAPTCHA to verify that you're human. After that, you'll receive your confirmation code in an email. Click the link in the email, enter the code on the web page, and once again confirm you're not a robot. From there, the unlock process begins and soon your device will be free of that annoying MDM lock. As you can see, we're now going through the usual setup process after unlocking the device. Typically, if the MDM lock were still present, you'd encounter a remote management screen right after connecting to Wi-Fi. However, in this case, that screen doesn't appear, which confirms that the MDM lock has been completely removed. Now, this unlock allows you full access to your device. You can update it, reset it, and use it just like a brand new phone without restrictions. This service is a permanent solution, meaning you won't have to worry about the lock coming back. There are temporary bypass options which are cheaper, but this method guarantees a full and lasting unlock. Next, we're verifying everything by checking the serial number to ensure that it's been properly unlocked. Now let's go over some alternative ways to remove the MDM lock legally. Many people find themselves stuck with these locks because their device was issued by a company or school, and when it's no longer needed for that purpose, the lock stays on. If that sounds like your situation, you have a few options to deal with this the right way. The best approach is to contact the organization that set up the MDM in the first place. Most of the time, they can remove the lock for you, especially if you received the device after your contract with them ended or if it's no longer needed for business. This is the simplest and most legitimate way to solve the problem. Another reliable option is to use Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. It's fast, safe, and completely legal. It helps you remove the MDM lock without any risk to your device or data. While other methods may look appealing, this one is proven to work and follows all the rules, so you can trust it as a solid solution. You could also try doing a factory reset on your device, but this only works in certain cases. It depends on how the MDM was originally installed. Sometimes a reset won't do the trick, and if that happens, you'll still need to fall back on one of the other methods I've mentioned. One quick thing to keep in mind, the unlock services we've mentioned only work in first world countries. But if you're in a place where these services aren't available or you don't want to use them, we've got a little extra help for you. Every week, we give away 250 free unlocks to our viewers. To enter the giveaway, simply like this video, subscribe and comment with your device model, IMEI, and country. 
Once you've done that, you're automatically entered into the draw. It's really that easy. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe so you can stay updated with more helpful content. And if this method worked for you or if you have any questions, drop a comment below. We're here to help and we'd love to hear from you.